Hello everyone, this is Anuj from Gadget Geek. I have been asked many times regarding a best password manager app, and guys, today I'll be showing you my favorite app, which I personally use myself, and it's the Dashlane. Dashlane provides password manager service, which safely secure your passwords. So basically, Dashlane fills all your passwords, payments, and personal details wherever you need them across different platforms such as Android, iPhone, and even on desktop. The service is available for both PC and Mac. So few months back I made a video on this app showing you how it works and why I think that it's the best password manager. I know there are lots of other options available but believe me I have tried those as well and I find Dashlane the best. Now in terms of working for Android and iOS devices it's really simple to use just download the app from Play Store or App Store and create your account. Now for the account creation you can sign up using the link in the description below. Dashlane is free for life on your first device which you can get at dashlane.com forward slash gadget gig and if you want to upgrade then use the promo code gadget gig which will offer you a discount on premium to use Dashlane everywhere. Now coming back to the usage whenever you are on the login page on your mobile Dashlane will ask you if you would like to log in with the save credentials or you can save now to use it later and here you can see that in just one tap I was able to log into this website. Apart from the passwords, you can also save your payment details as well as your personal details. So with this, you don't have to fill the usual things like your name and address again and again. And guys, this service is super secure and all your passwords and data is fully encrypted. For the desktop, you can download the software from the website and in addition to that, you can also install the Chrome extension. And now, the working is same. Whenever you're on the login page, you will see this D logo and you just have to click on it and choose your saved login details. I really find the feature of the payment and personal info option helpful on the desktop as you don't have to fill in the details again and again. Apart from that, Dashlane also offers a VPN service which you can use on both mobile and desktop. With this, you can access the website which are blocked by the ISP. But the main reason why I like the Dashlane over the others is the security. Here I'm talking about the identity dashboard where it will show you the details of the passwords you use. From here you can see how many times you have reused your password and overall it gives you a password health score. And here on this side you will see the security alerts which shows you if any of your passwords or data is on the dark web. It's really difficult to know about your leaked info on the web but with this option you can see the details and even know the type of data which got leaked. Overall, I'm using Dashlane as my daily driver for password manager for quite some time and I never had any issue with this service. You can also try it for free on your first device by signing up from the link in the description below. The free version will allow you to save up to 50 passwords which is also pretty good. And if you like the service then you can use the promo code GadgetGig to get some additional discount. So if you keep on forgetting your passwords or if you're like me who wants things done quickly without wasting time on login and payment pages then I highly recommend you to try out Dashlane. And as mentioned earlier, you can sign up using the link in the description below. So that's it guys, this was a quick video on the Dashlane password manager. Let us know if you like it and also do tell us if you also face issues with managing your passwords in the comment section below. So that's all for now. If you like this video, then please press the like button and subscribe to our channel Gadget Geek for more videos like this. Once again, this is Anuj signing off. And I'll see you in the next one.